Hey guys, in this day and age on YouTube, sometimes when you subscribe to somebody, it doesn't tell you when they upload. So, if you haven't hit that little notification bell under my videos, uh, go ahead and do so, so it actually tells you when I upload. It's amazing, isn't it? Or, you can just join my Discord where I post all my new videos right when I upload. With that, on with the video. Three, two, one. Punch it! Oh my god! Oh! <laughs> Hey guys, how's it going? My name is Neil and welcome back to Beam in G Drive. Sorry, it's been a couple days since I've uploaded an actual uh, Beam in G Drive video. I've been in Boston for PAX East, had a ton of fun. Got another PAX East blog, or vlog, coming up later today, so make sure you check that out. But for now, we are back in Beam in G Drive. And as you guys know, uh, the game was updated a couple days ago, and with that update came this bus. And there's already been quite a few awesome mods for this thing and in today's video we're gonna check out two of them and the first one we're gonna check out is the splittable bus and by that I mean it can be split straight in half down the middle well, through the side I guess so the only way I can really see testing this is to put one way down here and then run something into it at a pretty reasonable speed and see if it actually does well a split in half so uh, let's just park it right here. I think this is probably good enough. So let's park it right here. Oh, this is a big boy. And big boys take quite a while to turn. So let's leave that right there. Now, if we go to the selector and we go down to our bus here. Come on, load in. I have too many mods. If we go down to the Wentward, we should have a bu- Ooh, yes we do. So now we have two of every variant, but, uh, Half of them say splittable, so we're just going to put that right there, replace that with the splittable version. So this one should split in half, and it should be spectacular. So we have that there now, so now we need just something to run into it at full speed. And I think the best choice would be another bus, but a certain bus that has a certain rocket on it. So let's go ahead and spawn up the, uh, what's it called? The Jado? The Jado version. The hero version, that's what it's called. So we're going to spawn up... The hero version, not the splittable, because I don't want to split two and half right off the bat. I mean, we might get to it, but for now, I just want to split this one and half. So there we go. Come on. Here we go. Okay, is it lined up? Yes, it is. So let's do it. Let's see if we can split an entire bus in half. It should be awesome. Here we go. Three, two, one, and slow motion. Ooh, yes. <laughs> right down the middle, baby. Oh, it's beautiful. Wow. I mean, it's split straight in half, man. And our car's not, or our bus isn't doing so well. It's still, whoa! <laughs> well, there goes the rockets off into space. Anyway, yeah, quite a bit of damage to us, but at least we're not split in half like the other guy. Look at that. I mean, we, we are getting a little bit of stretchies here and there, but that is a clean cut. I don't know if we can get any cleaner than that, and this side's on fire for... Whatever reason. All right, I kind of want to do that again just because it's awesome. Why would you not want to split an entire bus in half again? Here we go. Here we go. Okay, maybe we should do it in first person this time. All right, and oh, buddy, zoom out and uh oh, oh, I didn't hit the middle. Uh oh, is it still gonna split in half? Yeah, it is. Of course it is. Look at that. <laughs> oh, it's awesome. That's so cool. I love it. It's just a perfect split down the middle. I wonder if this thing can still drive. No. No, it can't. Wait! Oh my god, look at the back! It's still going! <laughs> what? So, the gas pedal is connected right here, and it goes through time and space to control that. You know what? That, that makes perfect sense, actually. And Look at this part. It's like following it. That's some spooky stuff going on right there. I don't know. It's like a ghost bus, but yeah, it's still alive. It's still in it's still alive after being split in half. You can't say that about most things, especially people. You can't be split in half. And, well, I guess you could be. I'm sure some people have been split in half and are still alive, but very unlikely. But for the bus, it's no problem. All right, so what do you say we uh we spawn up the hero splittable edition and just see if sheer speed alone can rip this thing in half? I think it can. So, whoops, wrong one. Let's go back. And down here, blah, blah, blah. And let's go to the splittable hero. This should be pretty interesting to say the least. Now, should we hit that bus? 
No, no, we've already done that. So let's just, ooh, come on. Let's just get this thing moving and maybe go off a ramp. Or, well, actually, no, it says first. Let's just run straight into the wall and see if it splits in half. Although, it's just probably just going to crumple into a ball. I still want to see what's going to happen because I haven't done that yet. I haven't just ran this thing at full speed into the wall. So it should be awesome. Here we go. Oh, my God. Yeah. Oh, my Jesus. <laughs> I think it did split in half, but then immediately just compressed on itself. So, uh, it's not split in half, but it is, but it isn't. I don't know. It's kind of an in-between, but yeah, it's definitely not a bus anymore. The rockets are okay, though. They still work. Yeah, they do. <laughs> what? What are these things connected by Bluetooth? All right, so let's just, uh, let's just ramp this off something. There's a couple ramps over here that might actually work pretty well. Well, there's a hill anyway. It's going to send us flying. That's the main thing. I want to see if just, just hitting this ramp can split us in half here. So here we go. Oh, we're still together. Barely. The, the entire floor has broken off. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Oh! Uh -oh. oh. <laughs> I think we may have broken half, though. No. We're still holding on by literally a thread. A chair is holding this bus together right now. Makes perfect sense. And the rockets still have a little bit of juice, so we can do a little bit of a break dance. Now, that's something you're not going to see every day, a, a breakdancing, rocket-powered American flag bus. That was a mouthful. All right, so let's hit an actual ramp this time. I know there's a few on the other side of this, uh, on the other side of this right here. So let's just go right here. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, 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 uh-oh. Okay, we're going to turn. This thing does not want to turn. Okay, pause it. Okay. Spawn right here. There's a big jump towards the end. So let's just send this thing into space. Why don't we? Because, uh, I, I know it can because there's actually a campaign mode where you basically jump the entire city. Oh my god! Oh, okay. Already ripped in half. There goes the engine. <laughs> Still holding on by just a thread there, the, se the seats. And, uh, yeah. I would, I would say that's pretty much split in half. I mean, it's barely holding on. So, yeah. That's an awesome mod. Definitely check it out. Now, this next mod, I'm a little bit more excited about because... The possibilities are endless. So endless that need, we need to go to the endless highway just to unleash the power of this of this mod. So we're going to go to the SSRB. Oh, buddy. I'm excited. Might break my computer, but let's do it anyway. Okay, guys. So this mod actually makes the Jado Engines rocket boosters editable. So, you know, you in the, in the base model, you have a, a, a rockets, which is clearly awesome, but... They do run out after about 20 seconds, and they can't really get you to tip-top speed. So this mod basically allows you to edit all of the options related to the actual rocket. So uh, here, I'm going to show you real quick. So let's go to the car editor and go to the parts. And where is this thing? Is it under body? Yes, it is. Jado liquid-fueled rockets. So we're going to go to adjustable Jado liquid-fueled rockets. And then we are going to go to tuning. And as you can see, we have some options here. So... Right now, our fuel is at 470 liters, but we can literally just edit this to change it to, oh, I don't know, 500 mil. Whoa, wrong one, wrong one. 500 mil. Oh, God, what are you doing? I just want to I want to edit these. There we go. So we're just going to make that a ridiculous number, and then we're going to set that all the way up to there. And then we can even change the amount of power each rocket has. So what do you say we just crank these up to, what is that, 400,000 pounds? Oh my god. So, this is going to be a little bit ridiculous. I'm not going to mess with them anymore because I feel like that might break the game. So, uh, how fast do you think we're going to get this thing going? I'm saying a couple thousand miles an hour. And I tried this once before. And if you just kind of do this enough, it breaks the, it'll break the windows, of course. But if you do it a couple times, the rockets will just start flying everywhere. So, here we go. Boop, boop. There they go. It's ridiculous amounts of power here. So, we need to, we, if we're going to do this, we have to commit. So, are you guys ready? I'm not. Okay. <laughs> Three, two, one. Punch it! Oh, my God. Oh, <laughs> oh sweet Jesus. Oh, no. Oh, that's going to be hard to control. What did we get up to before everything, everything went bad? I didn't even see. That was so fast. Good God. I kind of want to pull up the G-Force meter just to see... Uh, what we can hit because it's gonna kill you instantly those amount of forces there, so uh, I'm gonna actually add this on here. So whoops 
There it is. Okay, so we're going to put that, where is it? Uh, right down here. This is going to be pretty crazy. All right, uh, three, two, one, boom! Oh, it went straight off the chart. Straight off the chart. Oh my good God. Keep it together. Oh. <laughs> the speedometer can't even catch up. Do you guys see that? It's not anywhere close to where we Good God, man. Okay, we need to, I guess we need to, look at that! Absolutely insane. All right, we need to pull up a different speedometer here because uh, this one is not working out too well. We need uh, airspeed, I believe. I think that'll actually give us a, a pretty good estimate of what we're actually dealing with here. So we'll put that, oh God, I have so many things on screen now. But it's all in the name of science. So here we go. And boom! Wow. 200, 300, 400. 500, 600, oh! <laughs> you know what? I think this map is not even, we need just a blank map. We need something with nothing on it so that there's nothing that we can run into because this thing is quite literally uncontrollable at these speeds. So, uh, let's just go to the grid map. <laughs> the plain old grid map that has nothing on it. Maybe this will work. Okay, so let's set this up again. Whoops. I'm gonna set it to pretty pretty much all the same. Just I, I'm going all out, absolutely bonkers. Just because, you know, why not? If it's if it's an option, I want to go as fast as I can. I'm trying to break a beam and G record here, ladies and gentlemen. So let's set all this to blah 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 blah. blah. Lots of fuel, lots of fuel. Uh, put that right there, and right there, and right there. Looking good. Looking very good. Okay, are you guys ready? I want to see how fast this thing can go. Three, two, one. Punch it! Well, now it goes in a straight line. Okay, 500, 600, 600. Oh, no. Oh, no, 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 no. Okay, just keep going, keep going, keep going, keep going. Go in a straight line, please. We're back on our tires. <laughs> oh, no. Come on. Come on. Okay, 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 okay. There we go. Okay, this is not working anymore. The engines are gone. Oh, man. Oh, man. Okay, can we keep this in a straight line, please? Can we keep this in a straight line, please? I think I may have overdone it. Just a tad. Just a tad. Whoa! <laughs> okay, you know what? Let's, uh, let's bring it down just a little bit. Just enough to where I can control it, you know? Um... So let's, yeah, let's let's bring this down to about half and see if that helps us out a little bit. Just because <laughs> I don't want to, I want to be able to control this thing a little bit. So maybe this will be a little bit better. And yeah, we can go in a straight line now. So let's see how fast this thing can get us going. 300, 400, keep it going. Everything's breaking. Everything's breaking. 500, 600, 600. No, 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 no. Where am I going? I don't know which way's up, which way's down. Oh no. I need like indestructible tires if I'm gonna do this. Do I have indestructible tires? I don't know if I do. What's this look like from first person, by the way? Ooh, there we go. God, that thing is quick. That is ridiculously fast. 300 miles an hour. Like nothing. Good God. Holy crap. Holy crap. Okay, okay. Okay, okay, okay. Okay, 300, yeah. Every, after a certain miles per hour, the tires just can't handle it anymore. And they just explode into a million pieces, which, you know, sucks. But uh, what you gonna do, I guess? So next thing I want to see mod creators make is just wings on this thing, so it can just be a, a space shuttle, basically. So, you know what? Let's see if we can put this on its back and see if we can just straight up fly. Eh, come on. No, come on, I want to see you fly, baby. All right, so... Oh, okay, pause it, pause it. And do we have enough thrust? I don't know. Anyway, here we go. Three, two, one. Yes! It worked! Kind of! Whoa! I need more, I need more power. So we're gonna have to crank back up the settings here so we can actually lift off, as they should as they say. So let's go back to tuning here. Put those up all the way, all the way to four hundred thousand. Not ridiculous at all. Not ridiculous at all. Okay, let's get this back up to speed where I want it. So, here. why does that keep ripping off? I don't know. And up here. Looking good, looking good, looking good, looking very good. Okay, pause it. And uh, let's go full speed, actually. And are you ready? Three, two, one, boom! Yeah! 
The flight didn't last very long, but uh, we still flied. I think if we had like stuff to, to control this thing in the air, we could we could make it to space. I know there is no space in this game, but can you imagine the possibilities? I kind of want to take this thing to the uh, the slopes just to see how far we can actually go. So let's go to the ski jumping arena. And uh, whoa, what am I doing? Wrong section. Let's take this thing to the ski jump arena and see if we can fly into space. I think it's possible. I really do. All right, so, oh, whoa, no, no, that's not what I meant to do. <laughs> Whoops, whoopsie doodles. Okay, let's just get down the hill here. Oh, okay, don't break anything, don't break. I gotta coast all the way down here, I'm, or I'm gonna crash basically immediately. So let's just let it go, and we're gonna punch it right towards the, uh, the bottom of the hill here. So right about, no! Yeah! <laughs> Dang it, I wish I could control this thing. Oh my sweet Jesus. Oh! And then we explode. Very, very fitting. Okay, let's try this again. Let's just do it all the way down this time, just to see if I can even control this thing. So, boom! Whoa, 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 I'm actually controlling it. I'm actually controlling it. Oh, where I was. Oh, we, we lost a rocket. That's unfortunate. Well, we're going pretty far this time, though. Keep it going, little bus. Come on, I believe in you. I wonder if I had the splittable version, if it would be in half by now. Definitely right there, but uh, yeah. So, that has been the adjustable Jado rocket and the splittable version of the bus. Both awesome mods, and there's more awesome mods for this thing coming out every day. And I think I might need to make a second video on the adjustable rocket in particular, because I feel like there's a lot of stuff that we could do with this that could be really entertaining. So if you have any ideas for that, by the way, let me know down below, and you might just see your idea on the next episode of Beam NG Drive. But for now, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe if you're not already. And I'll talk to you guys in the next one. See ya.